Hello, Taurus. Welcome. I'm Ryan. Thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading, so of course everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel. You're probably be three tarot. She's read for you as well. Thank you. Excuse me. See what's going on. Huh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I haven't I'm laughing because in two cards I haven't sensed this type of energy from since high school. <laughs> yeah, I have. Yeah, I haven't sensed this energy from high, since high school. Um, Wow. Isn't life funny? Isn't life funny? Isn't that what that's saying? We make plans and God laughs. There you are, Taurus. Gotcha. Okay. Is what it is. Um, yeah. The, the, the energy that I'm sensing from, you know, back in high school, I remember perfectly. Someone wore a shirt that says, love sucks. And what it meant was they had emotions and feelings for someone and it sucked because they couldn't be with them. And so it's like, love sucks. And it's kind of like, you say that, you know, you, you don't like love. But then at the same time, it's kind of like, well, it's because that you do have love. You do have emotions and feelings of love, but it's just you can't express it to who you want to express it to. You're showing me exactly that. You have these new emotions and feelings of love for something or maybe for someone. Um, and it's almost like <laughs> I'm not going to say like you're you're disgusted by these emotions and feelings of love that you feel. It's just almost kind of like a little bit of a guilty conscience. It's like, great, I have these new mixed emotions and feelings of love. I have these current emotions and feelings that I'm having, and now you put them together and it just doesn't mix very well. And it's causing a little bit of heartbreak and difficulty here, pain. Um, you're like, oh shit, I caught feelings. Even though this is definitely clearing the air for you, emotionally speaking, you're kind of saying, play cool, play cool, play cool. Um, it's also bringing up, problems and issues so whatever this new emotions and feelings of love are it is it's opened up a can of worms for you so what you're kind of saying is and great shit now what am i gonna do um <laughs> i don't know what is going on with this um there's a consideration of what you feel called to do there's a consideration of what you're not fully 100 emotionally over or you're possibly you know getting through and healing from i don't exactly know but you're saying, I know it's a risky move for now, but I'm going to just choose to stay put. I'm going to choose to stay put and maybe something else will kind of fall into place or maybe fall apart um, so that I can kind of move with it and, you know, shift some things around and just kind of see. But ultimately, you're trying to figure out like, great, great, great solution, solution, solution as to how to leverage this and kind of what to do. Okay. Yeah, like I said, you're just kind of saying, you know, let's just sweep that under the rug. Sweep it under the rug and no one will know it's there. Oh boy. Drink responsibly, Taurus.
I already know. <laughs> I already know. Oh, geez. I feel like you already know, too. Here we go again. What is it? Is it like that time of the year? Or is it, I'm looking at 555? Five, five, five. Must be the time of the year. Well, fall is around the corner. And there's the angels. So fall is around the corner. Spooky season. Yeah, even even you're kind of saying, I just want to move forward. I just want to. I don't want to deal with this. I don't want. I don't want to deal with my emotions and my feelings and my heart right now. Um, now you have to deal with your head. Now you have to deal with your thoughts. Um, so if you can't, if you can't go to the heart space, you go to the mental space. But then what happens is when you reject this one and you go up to this one, this one can't help but take note of what's going on within. So now there's a panic attack being created. And so, of course, because of this panic attack of stress, anxiety, and nerves, and you're saying, you know what, let me just focus on enjoying myself and having a good time. And that's where I'm like, be responsible, drink responsibly. You're trying to figure out ultimately which direction to go. So even though you're kind of like, no, 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 let's just kind of, you know, eyes facing forward. Let's just focus on moving forward. Nothing to see here, nothing going on. Um, yeah. You know you're in it. You know you're deep in it. Just as I told, who was that? I think it was Aquarius. Something has burrowed its way in to the psyche. To the point where it's like, hmm. Um, you know, you, you, can, you can try to escape your heart space into your mental space. But what happens in when you go back and forth so many times, it's kind of like, I can't go there, I can't go there. So... Who's in control at that point, Taurus? If you're making moves based off of what is happening to you mentally and emotionally, who's in control? Because you're showing me that even though this is causing a fixation as to what to do and how to move forward with all this, um, you keep giving me the energy of like, shit, shit, shit. Let's just move forward. There's nothing to see here. You're buying your time. And even as you're buying your time, you're kind of like, I don't know even what time it is. Everything's beginning to blur. Everything's beginning to blur, but you do know that you have to take and make some sort of responsible decision here as to how to manage all this. We're going to have four, four, four. So we have four, 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 five, five, five. Hmm. Yeah. You're showing me I am trying to balance and juggle everything for the sake of my own happiness. Um, That is, that is a dance. That is a dance of knowing what to control, what you can't control, and knowing what you can't control. And finding that, in a sense, that that, that center. Um, you show me that you, you can create your own happiness, which is interesting. But it almost kind of seems and feels like, but is it long-lasting, though? Or is it, you know, in a bottle? Hopefully not. Um... But you're kind of like, eh, it is what it is. It works for now. And it's like, well, like I said, be responsible. Of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with a water sign, an air sign, an earth sign, or a fire sign. They're all here. Goodbye. Okay,